Hey guys, it's Mischief Magus. Uh, this is the, uh, what video number is this? I can't count. Well, it's the, I don't know, sixth. Um, so, <laughs> a lot of you guys probably think that I look like Seth Rogen, which is cool and fine. Um, but the reason I'm making this video, it, it's not meant to be a long one. Um, but I wanted to kind of give you an idea. So, when cities and civilizations are made, depending on what planet rules the house that is rising as the civilization is being created, <laughs> that planet rules those kind of people. Now the reason I bring this up is because, and I have a list somewhere of all the civilizations that have been made and that are ruled by certain, um, certain planets. The two, the only two that I know offhand are the Chaldeans and the Jews. <laughs> and the reason why this, why, why are the Chaldeans ruled by the sun? Well, because when I think, I think this is how it works. When Chaldean land, I don't know what it's called, Chaldea, I, I, <laughs> I don't know what it's called, I'm literally thinking offhand. But when this civilization was created, the sun was ruling the Ascendant. I think that's how it is. So, the sun rules the Chaldeans. Now, I don't really know much about it. I'm not a history buff. I probably should read a little bit more about it. And some of you are probably thinking, well, you should read a little bit more before you study these sort of bizarro techniques and history lessons. Fine, sorry, whatever. Anyway, I thought that was interesting. The reason I bring this up is because I think it's fascinating when everybody thinks that I look like Seth Rogen, or if you don't, cool, but um, a lot of people have mentioned it. And I, I think Seth Rogen's Jewish. I, I don't know. But then they also start asking me, oh, are you Jewish? And my answer is, uh, no, I'm not. Even if I look it, it would be cool, I think. Um, one of my best friends is Jewish and, you know, I'm doesn't look anything like me, so I don't know. I don't know, but the reason I'm mentioning that is because it ties back to what I mentioned about the Chaldeans. So the sun rules them, so Saturn rules the Jews. Now why? Well, it's the same thing with Chaldean landville Tenberg, but it's with Jewish people. I guess wherever they founded their Jewish homeland, that's Saturn was rising at the time of their founding. I think, because every time I read and they say something, something, something for the Jews, because Saturn rules the Jews. And then I have to go back and I have to look and be like, why? And is this always the case? And th that's why, because when a civilization is created, or a city, or whatever, you look at the ascendant, you look at the sign that it's on, and then whatever sign that is, whatever planet that sign rules, that's who rules over that civil or that people. I think it's people, not civilization. The Chaldeans are a people. The Jews are a people. Jew land. It's not. It's not Chaldean land. It's the Chaldeans. So, I correct my thinking. It's not civilization. It's people. So, I just kind of wanted to bring that up. It's not really relevant in any way, shape, or form to what we're studying here, but. Um, I think it's funny because, um, and you know, I could, coincidence, maybe, I don't know, but my, my rising sign is Aquarius, and if you remember from the eccentric videos that I've showed you, well, who rules Aquarius? Saturn. Who, what does Saturn rule? The Jews. Put two and two together, maybe that kind of sort of makes a little sense to you? If not, just thought I'd point it out. But no, nobody goes around and is like, are you Chaldean? Yeah, bro. Chaldean all the way. <laughs> nobody does that. But, I mean, I don't know what Chaldeans look like, so I don't know. Anyway, just wanted to kind of share that stupid little tidbit.